welcome back today. I hope you guys are having a lovely day. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. It is just below. And if you're a regular coming back, hello, welcome back today. I hope you guys are having a great day. I feel like I've just said that. Anyway, so today I am, I was kind of dreaming the other night and I was like, how can I test out two eyeshadow palettes on the same day? So that's what I'm going to do today. And I'm going to do one eye with one eyeshadow palette and one eye with another eyeshadow palette. Um, so they might not look the same, but I wanna see which one lasts longer, what the quality is like. And I was like, that is kind of the only way I feel like I could do that. So that's what I've decided I'm gonna do. My hair's a bit of a mess, but hey ho. So I'm actually going to be testing out Soph's um, Ultra Eyeshadow Palette. This has got 24 eyeshadows in, and her new um, eyeshadow palette called Extra Spice. I should know this because I am absolutely in love with her new eyeshadow palette. Let's just show you. Look at this. So yeah, if you see, the colours are not that similar. Some are similar, but some aren't. So it will be interesting to try and make my eyes look the same. So I don't know whether to do like one blue eye, one kind of different colour eye, but I'm going to just see if I can make it work, really. Um, but yeah, look at them colours. They are pretty. Um, I really do like her new palette. I love shiny things and this has got some really nice colours. I really want to use like these ones here today, but I don't know if I'll be able to make an eyeshadow look because of this palette here. Try and make them similar. Um, but let's just get into this video guys and attempt to make an eyeshadow look with these two palettes. <laughs> So first off I'm going to use her old palette first because I feel like this is, even though this has more colours, the other palette's more brighter so I feel like I need to start with these ones first so then I can try and match my other eye with kind of this palette. So first off I'm going into iced tea and this is going in my crease. I need to just remember that I'm not doing both eyes at the same time which does get confusing for me. I will just start putting this on the other eye. It's really weird, like to just do one eye. Oh, I have primed my eyes. I will link all the makeup I am wearing today in the description box. Okay, now I'm going into a cup of tea. This is this one here. This again is going in my crease. Just first of all, first off building up the colours in my crease I do like the size of the mirrors on these palettes because they are huge and they're really just handy when you're putting your makeup on I find when a palette doesn't have a mirror like a decent mirror I'm like oh it does annoy me because like a lot of the time I don't use my desk, which I should, but I feel like when I'm filming it just doesn't work to use it because of like lighting and where it is because I don't have the biggest, well, I have a big room, but not like where I can just have space to bring my desk out and film with it, so. Okay. So now moving into the color danger, this is going on the outer eyelid and still a little bit in the crease. My cat is deciding to wake up the other housemates by crying. So cute. She's like, wake up, I'm awake, you'll wake up now. So I'm bringing it into kind of the middle bit of my eye as well, slowly. Okay, I've just changed my idea. I'm going to cover this all over my eyelid because I've just changed my idea, but I'm not putting it in the corner the inner corner of my eyelid. Dang it, 
always like whenever I have makeup like doing makeup I always feel like I need to listen to music so it's really weird not having music on I was about to just go over there oh it's gonna be so difficult this is a hard challenge I am struggling right now I'm going to go into festival flame and look at the color of that I'm just gonna use my finger to put it in the middle of my eyelid Not as bright as I thought it would be. The other two colours work like one. This one is quite similar to this one, even though like one's shiny and one's matte. So they actually blend pretty well into each other. I really want to go into this colour here, so I might put a little bit of it on the outer edge. Just dabbing it in the corner. Oh, for the final colour of that, I feel like I'm adding, I don't know, I might add more, um, is pink champagne. Again, I am going to actually, I'm going to use one of these. Okay, so on my lower lash line, I am going to go into Danger. And I'm actually going to put a bit of the glitter in, what was this called? Festival, I feel like? Festival Flames, I think it was called. actually really happy with this eye look even though I haven't got my eyelashes on or my eyeliner on I'm actually really happy with it it looks pretty um okay so let's move on to the next palette so next palette okay so we're gonna try and do hopefully something similar or near enough I really do like the, the kind of colors so first off I am going into cookie dough that's this one here I don't have one lighter to start off the in the crease so just hope for the best really just hope for the best I I just keep looking at the other eye and I love the like kind of light pink into the dark Kind of pink into the purple. Purple is my favourite colour, so maybe that's why. I don't actually wear purple that often, which is quite sad. I'm actually quite didn't realise I didn't wear it that often, but now I'm wearing it. I'm like, oh, I don't think when's the last time I wore it. Okay, I think that's all I can do with the crease because I don't really have. I've got chocolate orange, but this is more. I don't know, that's more of an orangey colour and I don't want to put that on. Okay. Just going to touch up that side. Oh, and this is so hard to do. When you do your eye makeup, you always go from this side to this side, this side to this side. And now I'm not doing that. It's so confusing. Okay. Uh, okay, this is going to be hard. Okay, so I have got a shiny colour that I can use in the middle. I might have to use every day for the inner bit. Um, and maybe... Enchant... Oh, maybe Enchanted... Enchanted... Enchanted. How can I not say that today? Enchanted. Um, or... Okay, um, first off, I feel like I need to go in with... Um, mold wine and this is just going to go all over my eyelid definitely more of a purple colour
Okay, and now in the middle, I am going into romance. I feel like I tested this one out on the last video and it's very shiny. So this is going to go in, I was gonna tap my finger. What is that gonna do? In the middle of my eyelid. But it's one thing about her new palette, it's so pretty, like the colours are just so pretty and very creamy and very pigmented. Even though her old palette are, but these are like bolder colours, like very bold. Yes, I'm definitely going to have a different eye look on this eye because that is nowhere near the other pink. The other pink's kind of a softer pink. Does that make sense? It's just softer, the other one. This one's more like, hey, I'm here, whereas the other one's like, oh, hi, it's nice to see you. Like, kind of, I want to describe it as shy, whereas this one's like bold, out there, confident. I don't know, that's how I, I'm seeing it. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. What, how would you describe the difference between her two palettes. Now I'm going to go into every day and that's going to go in the corner of my eye and again I'm going to use one of these. Okay that didn't blend as nicely, like the two shinies haven't blended as nicely as I thought they would. Like the other palette they blend so well. This one I'm like, ah. Oh. Do you see like that blended so nicely whereas that's just bump stop I feel. It's blended better but it's not as, I think it's because these are, like the glitter seems more noticeable whereas this one's kind of subtle okay now i'm going into enhance and this is going to just be dabbed in the outer corner of my eyelid dab 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 hi cat nope she came in had food and was like no nah, mum i'm going out now get the toddlers in the morning you suck now. That's pretty much what she's saying to me. Okay, this enhances a bit more like kind of dark. So I might just go over it or kind of mix mold wine and it together. Maybe I will get the colour I like more. Pretty happy. It's just that that one was a shiny, whereas this is matte, so it's, it's confusing my brain a bit. That's my eyes done. I kind of prefer the old palette. I don't know why. Just feel like this is party. This is kind of okay. You can get away with it in the day, um, and it's not as bright. And I feel I'm not doing anything today. I don't think so. It's not so bad. Like have, oh, I haven't done it under my eye. I just realised that. Let's fix that up. So now I'm just going to finish off my makeup look for the day and show you the finished look. At the moment though I am preferring this eye shadow. This is the ultra one. This is the spice. Just because, I don't know, it's more subtle. Like this pink is very bright, which I absolutely love. but. At the moment for the day, I feel like this one would be better. Anyway, gonna put on the rest of my face. Okay guys, this is my final look for the day. It doesn't look like I'm wearing two different eyeshadows, which is amazing. But there is a slight difference when you get closer, it's just further away. You're like, oh, okay, she's wearing the same. But yeah, this is my look for today. Um, I will link every product that I have put on my face in the description box if you guys want to know kind of what makeup I'm wearing. Um, one of the products I was using today, I remember when I first got it, I actually just used it on my eyelashes when it's for your eyebrows. So that's a funny thing that I used to do. And so yeah, what do you guys think of this look? Do you like it? Is it not for you? Um, have you tested out these two palettes? If you have, 
in the comments, comment below what you thought of them. What one is your favourite and what eyeshadow is your favourite? Like what one? Mine, I think from this palette um, is Infinity, 100%. I love Infinity. It's just super, super pretty. Um, from the other palette, oh, let me think. Um, I don't know. Oh, because... Um, Think from this palette is out of um, pink um, champagne and mixed berry. Them two are actually one of my favourite ones to go to. But yeah, um, I'm happy with it. Overall, I prefer this palette over her old one. I don't know why. I think it's because they're bolder. They're more kind of like I don't know. It's just different kind of eyeshadow. So it's kind of late in the evening and I need to take off my makeup because I kind of just want to get in the shower and get all clean. Um, so yeah, but overall, oh my god, like they both look exactly the same, both have lasted the same, both still look really amazing and it's been a really hot day in the UK, like super, super hot. And yeah, it still looks great. So I'm pretty happy with both eyeshadow palettes. Overall, I do prefer this one over her old one just because of the colours. I feel like the colours are just that little bit brighter and a little bit just cuter. Um, but yeah, and I saw my sister today, she really liked it. I don't know what kind of eye she liked, liked better, so I might like quickly give her a call and see what one she liked. Hello. Hello, you alright? Well, did I wake you? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I was just going to ask you what eyeshadow you liked more. What side? The sparkly, so the um, left side. Yeah, I think it was the left. The, the, the really sparkly one or the like little sparkly one? The sparkly one. Okay. <laughs> you go back to sleep. Sorry for waking you up. Mm -hmm. Bye. <laughs> Okay, so I think she preferred the same palette as me. This one, I can't believe I've woken her up. It's only like 7 o'clock, but she has been having a busy day. But yeah, so I, I really like both of them. Both are very good palettes. Definitely love her new eyeshadow palette. Well, folks, watch today, guys. I hope you liked that video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button just below. Um, yeah. Sorry, I was looking at my arms because there is a picture of me and Adam at, well, getting food and I look huge in that picture. Like, my arm is like, I don't know how, I can't even do it. Like, it was huge and looking at my arms like this, I'm like, okay. <laughs> it's very interesting how kind of pictures and angles kind of make you look different. <laughs> but that's fine. I'm just giggling to myself. Anyway, thanks for watching today, guys, and I hope you guys have a lovely day.